Jay from Bleacher Brothers coming here from Dunedin Stadium here in Dunedin, Florida to watch the Blue Jays and the Detroit Tigers spring training game today. Coming into the stadium is great. Unfortunately, parking right at the stadium only for season ticket holders and handicapped. So if you are not a season ticket holder and you are not handicapped, then your life sucks. Anyway, uh, it's great. There's a lot of actually fans that live actually right on the street that open up their, their houses and driveways to parking. Obviously, they charge for it, but 10 bucks directly across the stadium from not bad. So we just park, getting ready to head on in. So kind of take a little spot right here, what we're looking at. Here with Dave, we're getting, uh, we're getting ready to head into the stadium, and Dave's just helping us park here, giving us a little warning to, to be ready. So what do we got to watch out for here, Dave? got to watch out for the sun with those Yankee legs like that. You're going to burn up. <laughs> All right, well, we'll do that. Appreciate it, and thanks a lot, Dave. You got so it. See you later. Good Leading off the bottom half of the second inning for your Blue Jays, third baseman number 33 is Scott Rowland. Scott Rowland, dude. Hell yeah. He lives down in uh, Palm Beach County. Yep, 
says that always bring your glove and be prepared there. He's got the souvenir of a lifetime. Let's see that bad boy. Yeah, let's see the blood spot. Yeah, all right, there it is. Let's see that nose. It was a nice, oh yeah. Awesome. Tomorrow morning Wait, what's your website? Well, you got it, thanks a lot, Skip. Appreciate it. All the action takes place in the bleachers there. Bring your glove next time. Yes, I will. about Don Trell. He was once the Marlins ace and now he's fighting for a spot in the rotation. What's your take on that? Yeah, it kind of hurts my feelings a little bit, you know, because being from South Florida and being Marlins, I used to Maybe rotate all my game. games to when Don Trell would pitch. He was my favorite player. Now he's struggling a bit. Um, I, I don't know what to say about it, but I, I think he'll pull it out. I think it's just a mental funk that he's going through right now. All right, well, I appreciate it, Mike. And uh, by the way, where does the action take place? It takes place in the bleachers. Swing and a miss. Brothers signing off here from Dunedin Stadium, Dunedin, however you say the name, we haven't exactly figured it out yet, but anyway, it was a great game today, Blue Jays and the Tigers, 6-4 with the final score, worked out well, if you want the stadium, it's a great stadium to check out if you're a baseball fan, uh, it has the uh, feel of a uh, big league team, but with a smaller park, it was great, make sure you bring plenty of cash to the game, because the ATM has a limit, you can only take out $80, and they charge you $250 to take it out, so bring your cash beforehand, if you need more than $80, and you will since all the food and drinks are about uh, $100 million each like at any stadium, alright? But anyway, it was good. The, the uh, souvenir shop, not so happy in that. Didn't have much. It's only the second game of spring training and all their Blue Jays spring training t-shirts are actually on back order and sold out already. So definitely poor planning by the organization on that. Have a good one, buddy. So anyway. Uh, but I did manage to get some good Grapefruit League shirts, got this American Baseball, World Baseball Classic coming up. Stay tuned for live updates. I will be at the World Baseball Classic team game on Tuesday in Tampa where the American United States team takes on the New York Yankees. Derek Jeter playing for the U.S. team. Stay tuned for videos and live updates from there. Jay Johnson will be there live from Bleacher Brothers. Good stadium. Check it out, guys. All the action takes place in the Bleachers. I'll see you soon.